Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Harry Belafonte. Presenting the award for best performance by a leading actor in a musical, a former Tony winner and one of America's longtime premier entertainers. In my very first Broadway musical, a 1954 review called John Murray Anderson's Almanac, I was lucky enough to win a Tony. But I've been in awe all my life of the great performers who've brought down the house in Broadway musicals from 50 years ago until now. Bolger to Gregory Hines, from Bert Lahr to Nathan Lane. And so I feel especially honored tonight to be making this award. But before I do, here's a look back at some of the other greats who sang or danced their way through Tony's in the last 50 years. Oh, Met opera star Ezio Pinza was an early winner in South Pacific. Pickering. As Professor Henry Iggins, Rex Harrison couldn't really sing, like but it really didn't matter. Mm -hmm. Robert Every Preston charmed his way to a Tony, playing Harold Hill in The Music Man. Zero must tell had audiences laughing and crying at his definitive tevye in Fiddler on the Roof. And in this very theater, Britain's Michael Crawford introduced Broadway to the powers of the Phantom of the Opera. This year's four nominees are Savon Glover, Bring in the f Noise, Bring in the Funk, Nathan Lane for a funny thing on the way, happened on the way to the forum, Adam Pascal for Rent, Lou Diamond Phillips for The King and I. And the American Theatre Wing's Tony Award goes to Nathan Lane. A funny thing happened on the way to the floor. Thank you. I, I salute my fellow nominees and non-nominees. I'm very proud to have been a part of a very exciting season. Uh, this means a lot to me because, as you know, I'm an emotionally unstable, desperately needy little man. <laughs> you know, you're only as good as your material, and I'm in the funniest musical ever written by the great Larry Galbart, the late great Bert Shevelov, and the great Stephen Sondheim. Uh, I'd like to thank all of our producers, especially Scott Rudin, who postponed the show for a year and then brought it all back miraculously. I'd like to thank everyone at the St. James who makes the show possible backstage in front of house, uh, led by Artie Gaffin. I'd like to thank our terrific designers, our uh, wonderful choreographer, Rob Marshall, uh, Jerry Zachs, I love you. You didn't lose tonight. This is partly yours. And an incredible cast. Uh, uh, thank you all. They're giving me the bums rush in Melody. I've got to go!